Welcome to Atlanta, baby. Hell yeah, bub. You ready to go kill baby? I hope so. Good Lord will it. Dude, I can't believe we just had that deer at 15 yards. What's up, guys? You're probably wondering, where the heck is Charlie at? Who is this guy? Well, my name is Hunter Kent. For the last, I don't know, four or five years, I've been running a smaller YouTube channel. But uh, me and Charlie have become real good friends over this last year. And let's cut to him right now. He's probably laying in the bed. What's going on, guys? I know y'all are used to seeing me behind the camera making videos for y'all and stuff. Your boy's out for the rest of the season. Sad news, I'm looking at near Valentine's Day until I am able to do basically what I want again. Hanging tree stands and climbing up the ladders and stuff are things that the nurse said that I don't need to do. The wound's not going to heal properly. So the rest of the team's going up to Atlanta this week. Temperature's dropping. Does are getting chased by the big boys. I'm going to get y'all back with Hunter on the ride up there. But I just want to let y'all know if y'all like the merch, link below. Y'all support the channel. Get y'all some light boots, code FEATHER TIMES 10 for 10% off your purchase. I appreciate y'all, I love y'all. Good luck, Hunter. My tires. And Wait, my what'd you just pull out of that tire? Oh, a nail. Wow. Yeah, not fun. Well, what am, I, what am I doing here? Hopefully we're gonna go kill a big deer. You got a game plan? Kinda. Kinda sorta? Kinda sorta, not really. Figure it out. Alright boss man, what are we fixing fixing to do? Hang a deer stand. We got the tree picked out. Yeah. Hopefully it's good. Well you're hanging the deer stand, I'm not. Yeah, I'm I'm doing all the work. I'm just here filming you. Hang like this. That's all it is, do it. Breaking stuff. They didn't break it. This is how it's always been. All right, guys. Well, what time is it? Like two o'clock? It's got to be like two o'clock. Yeah. Well, we went and hung this stand earlier. It's because it's about to drive some monster trucks, practice, test them, do something. I don't know. So it's gonna be making a lot of racket. So we're gonna go ahead. You just had to hit that hill. Yep. I'm holding the camera, and you just had to hit that hill. But anyways. We're gonna go, go ahead and get in the stand. We saw a buck and six does earlier going to hang the stand. Deer on their feet. You gonna mess up? I hope, hope not. If you miss, you're going in that pond. That's fine. Deal? I'm deal. All right, bet. Y'all heard that. If he misses, he's jumping in the pond. You ready to go kill a big one? I hope so. Good Lord will it. Maybe he'll walk by.
his cousin and I'm like throwing the drops away from us filming a YouTube video with their monster trucks while we're filming a YouTube video hunting so
can see him. He's bleeding on that left side. He's bleeding on the left side. He's just standing there. Go down, baby. All right, what's up, guys? Uh, we just shot our deer about 45 minutes ago. About 60 yards that way. Came in from the bottoms. And it was like, shooter, shooter. Sure enough, that was him. But uh, really wasn't on the right side of the tree at the time, but he worked his way around about 25 yards. Shot, heard a loud thump. We think it went in low and hit opposite shoulder. We saw him run this way. He's bedded down over here. There's blood everywhere. Honestly, if we would have just backed out, I think he would have died right here. But we got a gun and we, we put our finishing touches on him just so he wouldn't suffer. I don't like to see deer suffer out here. It's just the humane way to get it done. We got it done with a bow as well, so thanks for Hunter for coming out and filming this. Well, let's go put our hands on him. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Here's where he jumped the fence. I could see him. Y'all can see him on the camera. There's blood all right there. Then he bedded down somewhere right over there, but we need to get across this fence. Biggest deer I've killed on this property. Well, he's done. It's been a journey the past week. Six days ago, we had him in there, 15 yards. Went to draw back. The rage decided it wanted to pull it early, and he ran away. Luckily, though, we sat last night. We didn't see a freaking deer. I mean, we didn't see anything. We saw a bunch of squirrels, and they were kind of making us mad, honestly. But uh, this morning we decided to go sit at a different spot. We didn't, we didn't really expect him to come in this morning, honestly, but he came in from the bottoms. If I would have been in where Hunter was sitting, I would have had like a 20 yard shot, maybe closer than that. But uh, he worked his way around about 25, maybe 27 yards, shot him. He, uh, he ran down. And then uh, he was suffering though, so. We put a finishing shot off camera. We don't like to see deer suffer. But uh, I can't thank Hunter enough to come out and filming. I've always wanted to get a buck on film. I thank the good Lord for putting us on this. I thank him for just all the blessings that he gives me. And I, I thank uh, my, my great grandfather. He's passed like seven years ago, I think. But without him, we wouldn't have this land to be able to hunt, to be honest with you. But we love you and we miss you, Papa. Thank you. <laughs>